course I had to get two different sizes because again I wanted to see which size medium or large would look best on me so I got medium and large shorts and I got medium and large top of course legging and we're gonna see that amplify what's going on because everyone is raving about it here we go I got 6.5 and 4.5 shorts we'll see we will see right now I got medium and large and let's see the difference between those two I got the same color because I got one top here we go so medium and large you see and then you see the difference in how long they are we'll see which one looks best I'm really afraid of camel toe I'm not gonna lie so we'll see here we go we have large and large right now the only th thing why I like longer shorts is because you can pull them up and make the glutes pop like you would not believe I mean, do you see it? I'll leave one a regular length. I mean, you tell me which one you think looks nicer. Up is very silky, very comfortable. There are pads in here. Nothing is digging in. I like those like straps that are thicker. Of course, the waistband is tight, and as you know, I store my body fat in my love handles and my stomach, and as you see, my love handles are popping out, even if it, this is a large, it's compressive. Lower belly is not as compressed, the compression is right here, and so if you have a mom pooch, you know what I'm talking about, so this is not going to be so sucked in for you, it's not going to be compressed. And like I said, I do love the length of them and I think longer shorts look better only for the purpose of making the glutes, glutes pop amazingly. Like, look at this. I really want to see a difference between the medium shorts right now so we're gonna do a transition really quickly I'm gonna make them long like they're supposed to be and then we're gonna put them side by side together I don't really feel a huge difference like I said I do believe that the longer shorts make the glutes pop better but this does too is this tighter it might be I don't really feel it that much uh, I'm gonna put a comparison right here so you can see yourself if my love handles pop out more with the medium or large and then the difference between the glutes of course because for me, when I'm trying this on, there, it doesn't feel like there's such a huge of a difference. The only thing I'm worried about is the cabin toe problem. That's the only thing that I'm worried about with smaller shorts or, you know, smaller leggings. So for me, it's always better to go up. I'm really excited to try the pink one and I think we should. We will see if that actually, you know, works with the 
kitty cat down there. And then we have a medium, just regular top, crop top, no pads, nothing. Are we gonna do without, without a bra? We'll see if it's see-through, I guess. You tell me what you think first, and I'm gonna tell you that I kinda see the hype now. I see the hype, I see the hype. It is pretty expensive, but I mean, it's so smooth, it's so soft. I'm not loving the fact that there is no like, oh, around the glutes something. I feel like it needs a little something. You know what I mean? Like I love when there's like a little scrunch around the glutes. That makes the glutes pop so good. But even then, this is gorgeous. I don't have to, of course, pull them up so high, but I feel like love handles with the medium are popping out bad. Like, I feel like they're more tight than the shorts. So, of course, I'm gonna ride them up, I'm gonna pull this down, and then I'm gonna feel better. Of course, I'm gonna return this and get a large because I think it just fits me better. For the shirt, medium works great. I have a large chest and large upper body, but it is it is great. It's very stretchy, very nice material. I don't think it's that see-through, but of course you can put in your own pads or wear a sports bra or you know a bra underneath. The last thing I have for this try-on haul is of course a large, so I wanted to see the amplified leggings, the difference between medium and large, and which one feels more comfortable for me, and of course I got a long sleeve, again, regular shirt, no pads, nothing large, and we will see which one is more comfortable. I just wanted to compare, and so of course you see my measurements, and you can compare yourself. Okay, well, this one is a bit different. Of course, you can see the large is not digging in so badly. So I do feel like large is good for me, but I have skinnier legs and I feel like I like I like the leg tightness of a medium, but then around the waist, I like a large. Again, I'm a complicatedly built human. Anyway, I mean, this is a win always, right? Like this is a win. The top is very cute. I would like for it to be like this long, like longer so it would cover my stomach. I think it looks very, very cute when your stomach is not showing. So just like that much, just that much, Alphalete, please. Just that much. Anyway, it's pretty comfortable. Like I said, no pads or anything. Um, same, same again. Depending on where you store your fat, if this is a problem for you or not. Or with the large, I feel like I'm more safe with the camel toe happening. As far as the color, the pink has my heart. The pink top, yes. The shorts. Not sure which ones I like better, but I think I would go with a large just because of my uh, love handles, like I said. And then I do like the leggings. Uh, it's just large is better. Really, again, depends on where you store that fat. Overall, pretty good haul. I see the hype with Amplify, although it is ex expensive. It is more expensive. And so make sure that if you buy something and you keep something, you truly love it. Like I said, always be picky because there's a lot of amazing activewear, activewear brands and you cannot keep it all. You cannot buy it all, you cannot keep it all, and you don't need that, many, that much activewear anyway. So, be picky, know what you like. I like the waistband of a large. I do not like the length of this. I want it to be longer. Love that. Just be picky, you know what I mean? Like, be picky. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Of course, you can always tag Alpha Lead. Maybe they will see this video. Bye.